This is your technical update from the LMAX Exchange Research and Analytics Desk for Wednesday, January 28, 2015. So after breaking down to a fresh 11-year low at 1098 on Monday, the market has since entered a period of correction to allow for daily studies to unwind from deep oversold levels. This correction could now extend towards previous support at 114.60, with an ideal lower top sought out somewhere below 1680 ahead of a bearish resumption. Sterling Dollar Cable has recently bro broken back above 150 after trading down to as low as 49.51 this year. The, mo the move back towards and above 150 has now exposed a retest of 52.70 further up. But a break and daily close above 52.70 would be required to take the immediate pressure off the downside and open the door for a retest of 54.85 further up. Inability to take out 152.70 will keep that pressure on the downside and open the door for a retest of the 2013 base at 148.13. Dollar Yen. Dollar Yen continues to consolidate over the past several weeks with the market locked between 115.55 and 121.85 further up. 121.85 represents the recent December seven year high and ultimately with the trend seen as uh, firmly bullish, a break of the 121.85 area is anticipated to open the door for a 125 target further up. Only back below 115.55 would compromise the bullish structure. Euro Swiss. Euro Swiss had recently been trading in a range post SNB shock between 97.10 and 102.50, but Tuesday's break above 102.50 now exposes uh, a further upside towards a measured move objective at 107. Ultimately, only back below the parity level would compromise the re newly adopted bullish outlook. Aussie dollar. Aussie dollar has been locked within an intense downtrend and the market is now focused on a test of a measured move at 77 further down. Look for current rallies to be very well capped ahead of 82.95 with a lower top sought out ahead of that bearish resumption. Dollar CAD. Dollar CAD has been locked within an intense uptrend recently trading to plus five year highs at 125. But with daily studies so highly overbought, it, isn't, it wouldn't be surprising to see the, the onset of a correction with the market seen back towards the 10 day moving average, which currently comes in around the 122.50 area. Ultimately, only a close below the 10 day moving average would compromise the immediate bullish outlook. Kiwi dollar. Kiwi has recently broken down below previous 2014 support at 7609 with the move exposing a measured move down towards 72. Look for any corrective rallies to now be very well capped ahead of that previous 7609 support in favor of a bearish resumption. SPX 500. The S&P 500 continues to show signs of topping, but a break back below Tuesday's low at 2018-2019 will be required to confirm and open the door for a retest of the key support which comes in the form of 1968, the 16th of December low. A break below 1968 would do a good job of opening the door for an acceleration of declines down towards the October base at 1820. But a break back above 2070 would, however, put the pressure back on the top side and expose a retest of the recent record highs just shy of 2100. Gold. Gold is in the process of continuing to recover after breaking out above key resistance at 1256, with the market now focused on a retest of next key resistance at 1345 from July of 2014. Ultimately, any setbacks now should be very well supported by that previous resistance at 1256. That's all for today.